Hi guys. So a few months ago, I thought as a bit of an experiment, I'd go off and try a couple of different nest boxes. So here's three nest boxes we have in this Avery for my Gordian finches. Now, this year, over the last couple months, we've had two clutches out of this one. And this is your normal budgie box. The only thing is it's got this little veranda here uh, to stop birds coming in from the side and, um, and, and fighting and bickering. This one here has had one clutch so far. And this, although it looks like a standard um, budgie box, it actually has a little um, corridor on the inside, which I don't know if you're going to be able to see in there. But if I open it up, you'll be able to see a bit clearer that it has this little alcove in there, so a little bit of a tunnel. Might be some eggs in there as well. Um, and so that little tunnel helps prevent chicks being pushed out the nest early because literally they've got to jump up onto that little tunnel, onto that little platform before they come out of the nest. So I was finding in, in the previous seasons, I was getting a lot of chicks being pushed out of the nest on this one where the nesting material was coming right up to the edge of the hole and chicks were coming out eager to get a feed and falling out, I believe. So I haven't lost any chicks from being thrown out the nest yet this year. Now this was a little bit of a, a fun one. This I thought would be a little bit interesting. It's a bit large for a Gordian finch nest. It's actually a small lorikeet nest. Now it has a big tunnel here. Once again, same sort of idea as this one, where it means that the finches are going to nest down here, and it's going to take a lot of effort for these young chicks to come up here and get pushed out. So they're only going to come out when they're ready. Now I know for a fact that there are some eggs in here, so I might give you a quick glimpse and see what you can see. Alright, hopefully you saw a, um, you maybe didn't see any eggs, but you certainly saw a female finch sitting on some eggs. So, that's a good sign. So, I haven't had any finches nest in here until this pair, so we'll see what happens. But I'm quite hopeful that we should actually have a successful hatching and have chicks come out of this nest box uh, on their own free will and not fall out. So, um, so yeah, so all in all, really, the Gordian finches don't mind any of these. Um, and so I'm, you know, they are a unique finch in the sense that they, they tend to, to nest in hollows, tree hollows, um, instead of building a, a nest in, in like tree branches. Um, so you do still want to provide something that resembles a bit of a, a tree hollow. Um, but I have seen lots of people using the little wicker baskets and things like that. Um, I tend not to go with that because once again, finches, the little chicks can be pushed out of the nest really easily on that and you will lose a lot. If you'd like this video, please subscribe to this channel and that way you won't miss out any of them when I upload them. Cheers.